Yeah. A little quick question for the level designers of X6. What the actual fuck is this jump here? Hello, ladies and gentlemen. It is I, Ludacris, and welcome back to the Mega Man X Mega Marathon. As we today start off with the most... Oh boy. The most atrocious and most hated game of the franchise, Mega Man X6. Oh boy, this is going to be an adventure. Because I've heard left and right just how absolutely horrible this game actually is. Like, top to bottom. Like... <sighs> but... I'm, not, I'm getting a little ahead of myself here. I don't want to judge a game based on, you know, what everybody else says about it. Because, at least I enjoyed X5 on my second playthrough, in spite of, you know, all the back-ass design choices they made, but... Nevertheless, as I've said previously, I've heard just how much... Uh, you know what, just start the game. Just start the fucking game. I'm literally wasting my time. And of course, I, uh, no, I don't want the damn wallpapers. Thank you. Well, okay. Three weeks ago, the space colony Eurasia was taken over by Sigma. Sigma hired a mysterious reploid, Dynamo. Dynamo led the Eurasia into orbit toward the Earth. Thus beginning the tragic Earth Crisis. Maverick Hunter Zero. Taking the Earth's destiny into his own hands, one reploid made a crash against the furious space colony. It was a successful attack and the space colony was destroyed. But although the Earth was saved, the huge explosion seriously damaged it. As for the battle against Sigma... X and Zero defeated Sigma and narrowly escaped with their lives. However, only one will return from the battle. A blue light. X still gripping a familiar saber in his hand. Three weeks later, at the present. There is so much pollution on the ruined Earth from the explosion that the Reploids can barely work. And a man is. A man is what? A man is what? Okay, well, this is going to be an adventure. And this time I'm going to set the game level to easy because I've learned my lesson with X5 that if you have it set to normal, it's going to be painful. But yeah, Mega Man X6. I have never played this one. Like, at all. Neither have I actually heard about it. But, fun fact by the way, after development for X5 was done, Capcom immediately went straight to X6. And this was all done without Keiji Inafune's permission. Well, I'm sure everybody knows that story, so I don't know why I'm regurgitating it. Just figured I'd point out a little few fun facts. What happened? I heard they avoided the collision. But they might as well have failed. And for this, we should be thankful? This is not all. Something else is going to happen. I feel uneasy. What is this? This is... Debris. But what from? Was there any final battle here? I wonder how many people and Reploids were sacrificed. Wait. This is! One week later. <laughs> 
It's finally done! I'm going mad, and it is so liberating. No. The plan has only just begun. I'm going to bring all low grade reploids into submission. Those too simple to understand my work. I will build an ideal world only for reploids. A wonderful world where I control everything. X. X. Wake up. Now you're the only one. There's no one else. There was, there was no one else's left to fight. <laughs> Get up now, X. I tell you, Maverick is acting up. Wake up! I'll send the detailed info later. You push to the scene! Alright, guess we're wasting no time. Most of the mechanoloids are become mavericks. It's been a long time. Stay alert, X. I'll be fine since I have the armor and saber. Since I fixed the falcon armor very quickly, the dash function is incomplete. Alright. Anyway, I'll stop the mechanoloids. Okay. Go to the entrance of the ruins ahead! Ah! That's the Giga Attack! And this is really hilarious. The Japanese voice acting was completely left in the international release. But man, you really used the saber so slowly. There you are. Are you alright? Beyond here is a giant mechanoloid, dude! It's suddenly activated due to a radioactive wave problem! We're afraid that we got hurt! I'll take care of this. Return to the hunter base now. Zoiks! Alright, man. Whatever you say. Come on, Scoob. It acts like it's possessed. Be careful out there. Come on, Scoob! <laughs> I I do a terrible Scooby Doo impression, not gonna lie. Okie dokie. I seriously What? Oh. I guess I killed it. And the explosion sound is the Crash Bandicoot TNT explosion. Why? Oh, what do you do? I need Zero was doing this. Who are you? Hi, Max. I am cold. I am investigating the Zero Nightmare. When? Did you say Zero Nightmare? What are you trying to do? What is your connection to the Zero Nightmare? What? What about Zero? Are you be? 
You must be behind this! You are dangerous. I'll dispose of you. Maverick Hunter, not amazing. We will destroy this Zero Nightmare. You are not wanted here. Keep out. That's why I prefer the Understanders for prefer! We are now beginning our mission to check out the eight areas that Isaac has sent investigators to investigate the Nightmare Phenomena. But considering the situations of the Maverick Hunters, you are only Hunter, you are the only Hunter who could accomplish these difficult missions. As we've lost Zero, you are our only hope. Can you do it, X? I'll do it. So yeah, definitely one thing that X5, X6 does way better than X5, a shop system. Though obviously I don't have anything right now. So, we unfortunately are going to have to rescue a ton of these Reploids. Alright, now the adventure truly begins. Commander Yanmark's supposed to be a guy, by the way, not a girl. Not even I'm able to explain why that is, but he's apparently a guy. Worst thing you could do is make him transgender or something like that. So yeah, things are pretty simple so far. <clears throat> X, I wonder when peace will return. I wanted you to live in peace and in a warless era. But we must put an end to this nightmare. Forgive me. All I can do is give you this armor. However, for security reasons, the armor won't work until you have all four programs combined. Collect four programs to complete the armor. Now, I will install a foot program of the blade armor. This program will enhance your dash performance and enable you to perform the mock dash. You can dash while jumping, and you'll be able and you'll be invincible in the beginning. For the earth, for the future, good luck. And up we go! And this is definitely something new that this game does. The fuck? I can't actually go upwards? How disappointing, really. They actually made the Falcon Armor a little bit useless here. What the hell? And I'm literally seeing something flash on the screen, like a bunch of pixels all at once. Can you see that? I'm seeing it right now. Probably might just be my screen, but... I don't know, man. This is really weird. It's tripping me up like nothing. Ugh. And here we go. So yeah, everything seems pretty fine so far. Ah! And already I died. Oh my god, that was close. Fuck, dude. So yeah, obviously there are a ton of secrets in this game. That I can't get at the moment, but that does not matter because we're not gonna do that right now.
Yep. Nothing, huh? All right. Well, that was a pretty simple stage, all things considered. You're the Nightmare Investigator, Commander Yanmark. Yes, I'm in charge of the Amazon area. Tell me, what is Zero up to? You must know something. Zero has nothing to do with this. Stop accusing him! I won't trust both the Maverick Hunter and Reploid Researcher. I don't know what you're thinking. I won't end up being betrayed and deleted. I will delete you first. Great boss fight! You know what? I could literally insert some audio from a conference meeting with Hitler and his higher ups. You know, that one. Alright, I feel like I cut this sh episode a little bit shorter than I anticipated, so I think I am going to do just one more stage. And this stage is terrible. The Central Museum, aka Ground Scarevich. Oh boy, this is going to be fun. Where's your mouth? This stage actually has all kinds of RNG bullshit that is so randomized that you might as well wonder what the what is even the point of this stage. Oh uh, yeah, and the nightmare souls. Well, the game itself is actually not that hard, but that's probably only because I'm playing this on easy mode. Freaking stupid. I hate this.
Hold on a moment. Save all the reploids. Here we go. Now what's this for? The blade armor helmet. Okay. Yeah, just look at the poor guy. He's going all, help me, help me. I'm literally right here in pacing distance. You can't get up? Fucking useless bunch of jackasses. Alright, more Nightmare Souls. Give me some more Nightmare Souls. There we go. Got the head parts, saved one of the reploids, and now we can move on. And there it is again, the flashing pixels. Yeah, I'm literally seeing them on my screen. This is so weird. Ah! Yeah. There we go. <laughs> I mean, it's a cool stage overall, but I seriously think it's tedious as hell. That you have to do at least four gauntlets in order to be able to move on. And I got the same exact path again. Now you decide there's no spikes? The fuck? And seriously, why are there so many balls of crunchies? Literally everywhere I go, I'm seeing squares and spheres of cheese puffs. Yeah, these stupid things. Alright, don't destroy that, because there is something I actually want to do. Ready? I'm collecting quite a lot of Nightmare Souls in this game. I just wonder what they're for. Ah! Alright, thanks for the health. And there we go. Now, I'm sure you know there's a reason why we're here. And that's because of this. Who are you? X, it's me. Don't you recognize me? I was damned so badly by the nightmare that the color of my body has been changed. Stop it! You can't fool me! You have become so insane that you can't even recognize me. That means you have become a maverick after all. 
As a Mavic Hunter and your friend, I'll retire you myself. I still gotta do the X6, X40 voice. Great boss fight! <laughs> Somehow, on easy mode, this game is so pathetic. <laughs> but whatever. My reputation has been damaged while I was away. Being thought of as some stupid toy. Zero? Zero! You're alive? <laughs> So X is alive, is he? Seems Sigma didn't defeat me after all. What? Wait, how? But I be but I searched all over for your parts, your signal, but I found nothing. So, what's well, that is most unfortunate. I hid myself while I tried to repair myself. <laughs> I had to wait until I was healed. Well, it's been an emotional reunion. But now we must face the nightmare. If the Reploids are eradicated, then the... Then mankind... No. The Earth itself will face a crisis. Let's go! Destroy the nightmare. And no, I am not doing the pussy ass X40 voice anymore. I am Zero, and I am a badass. Yes. Yes, you are. We will join hands. And never let anyone server us again. Let's go, Zero. Well, it looks like we're about to get through this thing. I wasn't really actually going to show my s entire second playthrough of this stage because, honestly, yeah, the fact that I literally have to go through all kinds of RNG bullshit is absolutely ridiculous. But we're just about close to Ground Scaravich, don't worry. As soon as I can destroy this fucking... Uh, you got to be kidding me. And there we have it, G everybody. Seriously, that took me so long for whatever reason because I literally kept dying on the same section to the point where I had only 4 lives left. Ah, uh, good grief. But we're here. This fucking uh dung beetle, I guess. I mean, he's rolling around a rock, but He's a freaking dung beetle! Grant Skarevich, why do you need to steal from another ruin? Hmm. You seem to be very close to the nightmares. I am cursed. I know it. You are, Zero. I heard you were dead. I really wanted to obtain your DNA data, but I no longer need it. What do you mean? You can fight me to find out. call it here for today ladies and gentlemen so thank you all for watching this first ever episode of me playing x6 one of the worst games in the entire Mega Man franchise and i bet you all to do farewell have yourselves a lovely day and until next time this is Lunar Chris signing out <laughs>